Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to be taking a look at a game called Mushihime-sama Futari for the Xbox 360, which is a sequel to the original Mushihime-sama for the Xbox 360, which I also reviewed a while back. And when I reviewed that first game, I gave it a lot of high praise for basically being just a great example of an amazing bullet hell shooter developed by Cave. And I'm pretty much going to be doing the same thing here, praising this game a lot for just being an amazing bullet hell shooter, again, developed and published by Cave. But I will say, before I go more into detail, that I do think this game is an improvement over the original, and perhaps best of all, it's also region-free. So if you're an Xbox 360 owner in North America or Europe, you might want to take special note of this game. So, as I've already stated, and as should be pretty apparent by the gameplay footage, Mushihime-sama Futari is a bullet hell shooter, and I think it's actually one of Cave's bullet helliest games. If that's even a word, it is very challenging, the screen fills up with bullets very quickly, and you have to be very careful with your movements if you want to avoid dying. I think, aside from the visual style, it has the most in common with the Dodonpachi series you have two different fire modes, one that has a wider spread and allows you to move more swiftly but it's weaker and a more narrow shot that is more powerful but slows down your movements a little bit. Altogether this game isn't terribly different from the first one. The most major addition I think is the inclusion of a new playable character that actually has different shot types from the original Mushihime but overall it controls very well. It's very precise the hit detection is spot on, and it's very challenging. This is definitely a worthy follow-up to the original Mushihime-sama, which, like I said before, is also really good. Not only is the gameplay in Mushihime Samafutari really good, there's actually quite a few different gameplay modes to choose from. You get the original version 1.5, which includes the arcade and updated Xbox 360 modes, but you also get a very cool arranged mode where you can swap back and forth between the two playable characters and you can make use of force fields that allow you to slow down and even deflect bullets on screen, and this is a great mode for racking up really outrageous high scores. There's also a novice mode, training mode, and a score attack mode, so if you're a shooter fan, on top of the great gameplay, there's actually a lot of content here to keep you interested beyond just playing through the arcade mode. The presentation in Mushihime-sama Futari is also amazing, and I think this really sets these games apart from Cave's other shooters, which typically feature lots of jets and spaceships, giant robots, lots of futuristic technology, these games go for a much more fantasy look and feel. You're flying through forests on the backs of giant magical beetles and dragons, destroying other giant insects and birds and giant lizards. In terms of the theme and the visual style, Mushihime-sama definitely stands out from the crowd and the soundtrack is really excellent too. It has a very soft, whimsical sound to it, but it keeps the techno and electronica beats, which ends up sounding really good. So both in terms of the visuals and the sound design, Mushihime-sama is a very colorful game. I actually think this is some of the best presentation in any cave shooter, and it complements the gameplay very well.
So I really enjoyed this game and I can easily recommend it to shoot 'em up fans and to pretty much anybody who owns an Xbox 360 because like I said it is region free so I would recommend picking up a copy. If you take a look online, prices can vary from 30 to 40 bucks for a standalone copy and 80 or more for the special edition that comes with the soundtrack, but either way, I'd say this game is worth picking up. It is a prime example of a really great cave bullet hell shooter. They don't make them much better than this. Mushihime Sama Futari, awesome game.